Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying three varieties of David's Cookies. These are David's Cookies, a bite above the rest. I have the Vanilla Florentine Lace. Uh, butter Pecan Melt Aways, which look really good. And the Lemon Cooler Cashew Melt Aways. These were $2.99 a box at Home Goods. There are nine cookies, approximately nine cookies in the container. <laughs> and these, the Vanilla Florentine Lace, are 90 calories each. They are made in Cedar Grove, New Jersey. And I'm not sure. They open like a donut pack. Well, you, okay. I was gonna say, you say that, but I don't, okay. Oh, so like mm. this. They oh, good. and they're very thin, but yet they, like they have a, yes. <laughs> They're very thin like sandwich cookies. Let me see if it has a description on the back. Uh, David's cookies and other desserts are made with only the finest ingredients. There's none better. Visit davidscookies.com for a complete line of David's cookies and gift items. These smell deep fried. Truth be told, they look and taste deep fried. Mm-hmm. Hmm. They do taste deep fried. They're good. They're very crunchy. Yes, they have a, a it, they have a deep fried flavor. Mm -hmm. And they're like brown and lumpy like something deep fried. I don't know that I taste a lot of vanilla. No, neither. A little bit. I think vanilla is all in that cream and you don't get a lot of that cream. Mm -mm. You know, that could be just really thinly baked cookies too. Because we've seen it on like the Bake Off. Remember they did the, the lace cookies and they're, they're just a little, they're mm -hmm. really paper thin almost. You can see through them sometimes. The first ingredient is white chocolate coating. Yeah. I like it. I really do. I do too. They're yeah, different. It's very, very different than any cookie that I've ever had especially a boxed cookie like this. Mm -hmm. I've never bought a cookie from the store that has that texture. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, it, it tastes deep fried. It really does. It's, it's good though. <laughs> it is good. It's, it's not as sweet as I was expecting. No, it's not. It, no, it's not an overly sweet cookie, but it's, it, there's enough of that flavor from the, from the deep fried flavor that you kind of don't miss the sweetness. It's true. Like a donut, a really thin donut. Mm -hmm. That's what it kind of reminds me of. Um, okay, these are 80 calories and there are 12 cookies in the serving. This is the uh, butter pecan melt away. Ah. I like mm. that they're all sealed. This they look, look like, like a wedding, wedding cookie. Yeah, yeah it's and a wedding in, cookie. They're in little pouches with little four. There's yeah. four cookies in each little cup. Yeah. And I'll have a picture. Mm, Do you want to have one? Yeah, you can bite one in too. Because these are perfect. No, you broke it. That is pretty much a wedding mm -hmm. Yeah, that's that's exactly what that tastes like. That's a good. I've had better wedding cookies, I hate to say it, but I like good. that a lot though. Yeah, they're very, very good. They're again I think I'm just missing some of that sweetness. Mm. I like it a lot. It it it's not it's not a sweet cookie like a, a chocolate cookie or a, uh, you, know, you know, it doesn't have chocolate in it. So it, it, it's just, it's not as sweet as one of those, but I think it's very sweet. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just... I, it's sweet enough for me. And, I guess and maybe, I like sweet things. Maybe but, the powdered sugar is not adding as much as I'm expecting it to add. But I like um, shortbread cookies too. Yeah, they so, kind of remind you of shortbread. So I like a plainer cookie um, a lot of times anyway. So for me... These hit the spot, and I like the size of them too. They're, yeah, they're, they're a good a, size. A very good size. So you wonder if it's worth 80 calories? I think it is. And now for the lowest one, 70 calories per cookie, and they're 12. We've this, literally gone down. Yeah. 90, 80, and 70. This is the lemon cooler cashew melt away. So it'll look the same, yeah, except it'll be lemon. Here, you had a really good luck breaking your last time. Okay. Yeah, here, you take the bigger one, because I took the bigger side last time. I like those. Mm -hmm. 
You immediately get lemon. Mm -hmm. But it's not a, um, a, a cleaner lemon. It's just a nice, fresh yeah. lemon. Yeah, I, that's nice. I like those, but I would not want a lot of those. I wouldn't either. I would get tired of them. Mm -hmm. I would I would get very tired of that lemon flavor. Mm -hmm. It tastes like a, we've made Ashley lemon cakes, just a lemon box mm -hmm. mix cake. That's the kind of lemon that it tastes like. The cake, not the frosting. The cake, yes. It tastes like a lemon cake. Yeah. Because the frosting what brings a lot of that lemon flavor, that overpowering lemon right. flavor. The cake itself is pretty pretty mild. That's what I agree with. That's what they're on me. So what uh, what order? <clears throat> What's your order? I have one. Probably the butter pecan. Okay. And then the meltaways and the lemon. Okay, mine is the. Um, You'd go. Not the meltaways. You said the butter pecan and then the Florentine lace. Florentine lace, I'm sorry. Okay. Yeah. My, me, I'd go in this order that we tried them. Right. I like this order because I like that deep fried. <laughs> I like that deep fried thing. I like uh, them too. And then I like the, the butter pecan and then lastly would be the lemon. Just because, I mean, I like lemon, I like lemon cake. But I don't want lemon cake all the time. Right. So if I'm going to buy a whole box of something that I'm not going to get tired of, it's going to be one of these yeah. soon. Yeah, I, I agree. They're, they're both, these people both are really good. But I think they're good quality. I they really are. do. I I'm like still them. missing a little bit of that sweetness, but I think I would I would still enjoy them. It's mm -hmm. just not it's like I use, need all that sweetness. They anyway. use plenty of pecans. Uh, this well, this one used pecans. Those this cashews. Uh, used cashews. They use plenty of nuts in these. Yeah. So you do um, you do get the texture of those as well, mm -hmm. which adds to it. Yeah. So. Yeah, these are really good. If you've ever tried any of David's cookies, let us know in the comments below which ones you've tried because these were the only ones I saw at Home Goods. If they had had more, I would have bought them all just because I'd never seen them before. And I thought, you know, we have the opportunity. I'm going to buy what I see. So this is all that I saw. So you'll have to let me know what you have available in your area. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.